Everybody back. Possibly last part of Mega Man 6. We'll see how it work. It goes. Uh, I should be definitely using this. Idiot. Woo! Don't care. I'll grab this one, though. Oh, God, get over him. Ugh. Okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. Yep, patches. All right. All right. Got to fight these eight fuck asses again. Let's start with this one. See what it's going to be. Yamato man. Let's get the super tomahawk. So much fucking health uh, to use, and then they they do give you those. So. Fucking evil ass fucking asshole plant man. But I got myself this time the uh, blizzard attack. I don't think it goes through his shield, but. Does a lot of damage to him. Shit. Am I out of it already? All right. I think I wasted a few shots. You don't get that many shots of it, I guess. But you got more than that. Uh oh. Oh, really? Capped you in the dome, asshole. What do we got, Nightman? He's the incredibly useful Yamato Spear. The hell is it? Oh, it's over there. Oh, no! Oh, shit. Oh, why did I do that? Die. Centaur Man! Alright, we want the Night Crush here, obviously. You dead. Our friend Wind Man, who I hate. Well, I think with nine uh, things, I, I should be fine, right? <laughs> I gotta use the fucking centaur flash, obviously. You gotta wait till he's completely vulnerable. There we go. Actually, did well that time. Tomahawk man. Another one that I don't like fighting, but got my plant barrier, my my PB. Yeah, I'm remembering the technique now. You dead? You dead? Fuck you. Should be f you dead? You dead? Fuck him. <laughs> he dead? He dead? Fuck you. Okay, pl fucking uh, play man. He's easy. He's the windstorm on him. Ah, this is so racist. Die, you piece of shit. <laughs> oh. Well, I mean, by process of elimination, we know that that's uh, Blizzard Man, so I might as well get the Flame Blast ready. Really? 
I really don't want to be in a corner like this. Uh, hold on. Got him. Got him! All right. Oh, God. Well, that went quickly and relatively painless, huh? Holy shit. So maybe, yeah, I think I think this is going to be the last one here. And there goes the heat, of course. <sighs> Alright, here we go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I knew it was there, too. Mm -hmm. These idiotic things. Get him! Yeah, Eddie. How'd you get here anyway? Oh, yeah! I'm actually gonna use the power adapter on him the first time. He's about to fight Wily, but... Oh, that was dumb. Damn it. Oh! Yeah, I didn't get the chance to pause. I was actually... My hand was on the start button. Alright, 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 alright. Let's fail. I, I completely fucked that up. Let's just put it there. How many lives do I have? I want to check. And then I'm, okay, alright. Not many, but... It doesn't matter that much. I would just refill my mag all my stuff, you know? Magic, I must say. You could use Beat here, too. But despite all the trouble you go through getting him, not that useful. I mostly get him because it's, uh, you know, 100% run. Yeah, I was like, that shot, because I, I paused, it canceled the shot. This is the second time, but I'll continue with the power adapter. Die, you fuck! Alright. Alright, if I, I'm gonna use Silver Tomahawks. If I run out of them, I'll use B. Should be fine, though. It's over. Oh! That's it! And this time, you actually catch him. Mega Man brought a rope this time, and he actually goes to jail. I don't know why it's in, like, acrylic German. But there you go. Sentenced to prison for his crimes. Dr. Wiley now rules over a prison cell. Well, at least he rules it. At long last, the world is at peace. Except he's got a backup plan. That's why I went, uh, he's got four robot masters waiting in the wings to break him out of prison. That's how Mega Man 7 starts. I actually did this LP. Not only did I do this LP in a day, I did the first, like, all the eight stages, you know, in, like, one sitting. And then I did some other shit. I think I watched some, like, YouTube videos. I was talking to my friend Andrew and... Um, got some other shit done, and then I was like, you know what? Tanya's not up yet, so I can't start working yet. Let's play a little more Mega Man, and I wound up, like, beating the game. <laughs> so actually, this is a one-day LP. What's next? I know the thing's behind me. Uh, there it is. After Mega Man 6, what's next? Oh, shit, I gotta install that. All right. That'd be interesting. Got a fighting game coming up next. I'll tell you at the end, though. 
Flame Man, you're so racist. <laughs> okay. Yeah, honestly, this was the most fun I've ever had playing Mega Man 6. I just really, really hate Plant Man's stage. I hate Plant Man, and I hate his stage. But mostly, I hate his stage. I'm not a big fan of Wind Man either, but at least his stage is kind of cool. But yeah, just like trying to rush through it actually made it more fun. Like, I think if you play like a traditional Mega Man where you try and beat every enemy that's in your way and just shoot everything, you're gonna have a bad time. You gotta like just try to get past the levels. There's no knowing to start with Plant Man's, even though it's like the hardest fucking stage in the whole fucking game. You get that Rush Jet Adapter and you're, you're gold, man. I'm not as much looking forward to Mega Man 7 because I actually like that even less. Even though it's a cool game, it's just it's not a great Mega Man game. The problem that I have with it, with Mega Man 7, is that Mega Man's sprite is too fucking big on the screen. And it seems to affect the controls. It seems to make it like harder to dodge shit. Um, that's just the way I feel about it. Like, And especially, like, like Mega Man 7 came out, like, almost at the same time as Mega Man X2, and Mega Man X2 was, like, so fucking good, you know? Like, X2 was amazing. And X was amazing, too, but X2 was, like, way more amazing. I mean, X2 is probably, like, my favorite Mega Man game, uh, you know, like, of all time. Like, when I talk about, like, my favorite Mega Man, like, classic series game, it's 4. But when I talk about, like, all the series, it's Mega Man X2, probably. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know, man. Yamato, man. Some of the some of the designs in this were done by kids, from what I understand. That there was actually a contest to design a robot master, and I think it was Nightman was one of the one. There were two winners. One was Nightman, and the other I forget the other one. I know Nightman was one, and then they did it again for Mega Man Eight, and it was like Clown Man and uh, I think Astro Man. Astro Man was super cool, though, so, like, that was kind of cool. Uh, Mega Man 8 was a lot of fun on the PlayStation. Although I didn't actually have it for PlayStation. I had it for GameCube when I got the collection. Because I could never get a fucking copy of Mega Man 8 for PlayStation. I had, like, X4 and X5 and X6. But I never had Mega Man 7... Uh, no, 8, rather, on the actual... I might have had it on the Saturn. No, I didn't have it on the Saturn. Oh, well. There you go. I gotta install the next game. Okay, so the next game that I'm gonna do, the next action game, is actually a fighting game um, with a story mode, kind of like how I did Mortal Kombat, and I did Mortal Kombat X like that. And you get where I'm going with this, same developer. I'm going to be doing Injustice Gods Among Us. Now, I'm not nearly as good at Injustice as I was at Mortal Kombat and Mortal Kombat X, but I think I will. I'll have to get good, you know? I'll have to get good. And I played it. I originally played it on Xbox 360, so it'll be interesting. See, to be continued. It's like, Mega Man 7 really is the second part of this story. Um, but yeah, Injustice, I, I got the PC version uh, earlier this year, the Steam Summer Sale. Uh, this is 2015. I don't know if it's 2015 when you guys are hearing this. Probably not, now that I think of it. Uh, it's probably 2016 when you're hearing this. But I got in the Steam Summer Sale, and I never even installed it or anything. I was like, oh, that'll be good for an LP. And I bought it, because it's on sale, you know, and, uh... But then I never got to playing it, because I was, like, playing Mortal Kombat X, and I never wanted to get my fight on. I'm like, I'm playing Mortal Kombat X, you know? Because that's, like, the best fighting game ever. Injustice is really good, though. Um, even though it's a three-button fighter, it's still a really cool game. Um, and I will be playing the story mode. So, I'll see you guys, um, real soon with some Injustice. And, uh, this is the end of Mega Man 6, so I gotta say, what I always say... When I reach the end, fuck you.